I'm Magna Levy, and this is your UFC Minute. As the fighters' wins begin to add up, the pressure to maintain momentum becomes a major factor. Every fighter who competes in the octagon will tell you that he will take a win by any means possible. But as one of the UFC's top strikers, this heavyweight star is taking the to finish each of his opponents during his winning streak by way of spectacular knockout. That's it for today. Stay tuned for your next UFC Minute, and I'll see you at the fights. Well, what a pop from the crowd as this guy makes the walk. Such a well-rounded fighter. And you got to think when the opponent breaks him down on film, not a lot of weaknesses jump out of the video. This is a true mixed martial artist. May not stand out in any one area, but plus skills across the board. Probably comfortable just about anywhere this fight goes tonight. This guy has outstanding takedown defense. His sprawl, his timing, and his ability to get up are amongst the best in the world. as this guy makes the walk. Such a well-rounded fighter, and you got to think when the opponent breaks him down on film, not a lot of weaknesses jump out of the video. This is a true mixed martial artist. May not stand out in any one area, but plus skills across the board. Probably comfortable just about anywhere this fight goes tonight. This guy has outstanding takedown defense. His sprawl, his timing, and his ability to get up are amongst the best in the world. Well, the crowd pops as this guy makes the walk to the octagon, and you can see why if you've watched film on him. This is a true mixed martial artist, plus skills in all areas, and figures to be a handful, really, for anybody in this division. Probably comfortable tonight anywhere the fight goes. Truly a well-rounded MMA fighter. You know, we, we, we trot that term out there a lot. This guy fits the bill. He's an extremely well-rounded mixed martial artist. Fantastic stand-up, great wrestler, and very slick on the ground. He's worked hard to have world-class skills in every aspect of the sport, and there are very few, if any, holes in his game. Hard tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So three years the gap in age between these two fighters, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. To get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. All right, you ready? You ready? All right, here we go. All right, round one is underway. Capacity crowd on hand to see this young man, and why not? Have you seen the highlight reel? This man has put together one of the best knockout streaks this division has ever seen. Big oh, 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 no! That's He's it! Out. That's it! Beautiful strike here to end the fight early in the first. Yes, sir, it goes into the books as a first round win by knockout, near perfect execution. The technique was absolutely gorgeous. And again, when you catch a guy early, maybe you're getting him cold before he's had a chance to work up a sweat or even get into the fight a little bit. Those strikes can have a bigger effect, and it certainly did here tonight. Let's look at that from another angle. Great angle here. 
smack. Look at that elbow. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout for him here tonight. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at 24 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Davis. So there's the man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here tonight as he gets his hand raised and does so emphatically by way of the KO. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way at the end of the night, I'm not sure. Still a few fights to go, but at the very least, you can be sure his next fight will be a big one, and he will celebrate deep into the night with his teammates, his coaches, and his friends after this. All right, coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown. Hit man with a tip on a plate that he better clap when he cast that ball. Aims cast out with a straight kick. I see they strap and they got no calls. So I'm over breaking over. Well, what a pop from the crowd as this guy makes the walk. Such a well rounded fighter. And you got to think when the opponent breaks him down on film, not a lot of weaknesses jump out of the video. This is a true mixed martial artist. May not stand out in any one area, but plus skills across the board. Probably comfortable just about anywhere this fight goes tonight. This guy is extremely well-rounded. His submissions are world-class. His striking is excellent. And he is extremely unpredictable in what attack he chooses to go with. says this guy makes the walk to the octagon and you can see why if you've watched film on him this is a true mixed martial artist plus skills in all areas and figures to be a handful really for anybody in this division probably comfortable tonight anywhere the fight goes truly a well-rounded mma fighter you know we, we we trot that term out there a lot this guy fits the bill He's an extremely well-rounded mixed martial artist. Fantastic stand-up, great wrestler, and very slick on the ground. He's worked hard to have world-class skills at every aspect of the sport, and there are very few, if any, holes in his game. the tape for this heavyweight fight. Well, how about the age discrepancy here? More than 15 years apart. Some differences in height and reach as well. Here's Bruce Buffer. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we go. All right, round one is upon us, Joe Rogan, and this man sold a lot of tickets here tonight. When you put together a winning streak like this, your fan base is gonna swell. That is exactly what has happened to this young man here tonight. And if he can win this fight, Joe, you gotta think his next one will be for the UFC title. He's doing a great job of timing these shots. Lands a punch. All right, first round is underway. We'll see how long it takes for him to find a home for these patented, powerful overhand punches. Always a big weapon of his on fight night. We'll see how soon he can get it going tonight. Oh, that punch will count, landed flush. Beautiful right leg kick there. There's a kick. Johnson gets caught with that punch. He's doing a really good job of timing his shots and landing a good series of strikes here. Oh, he lands a elbow. huge elbow to the head. Nice jab. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Finds a home for that left hook. Good right hand on the He's hurt. He's hurt. He's hurt. He is rocked. Oh, that one appeared to stun him. Oh, big knee. He's hurt. This fight is dangerously Ooh. close to being stunned. Jab. Oh, huge 
shot there, lands flush. I like the way he mixed that up here. Oh! Oh, he's getting hit! Whoa! Oh, he's out! Wow! Wow! That was excellent timing here to land a big left hand to stop the fight. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there, Joe. Landed flush, and I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him, but for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. And let's see that again. Boom! Out cold. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called us off to this contest at three minutes, 19 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, David! So there he is, the man of the moment. Certainly maximized the showcase here tonight, Joey. Gets a big win by way of the knockout. Certainly kept the judges out of it here tonight. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way, but there will be no wiping the smile off of his face tonight. To become a legend in the UFC, a fighter needs someone to push him to be great. McGregor had Diaz. Jones had Cormier, and Silva had Sonnen. Each series didn't just pit the best against the best, but it matched up rivals that had personal scores to settle. And when the octagon door shut, the bad blood reached a boiling point. Who will be the one to step up and put this feud to rest, or give up bragging rights once and for all? It's a UFC heavyweight showdown. Prelims, no more. Here he is making his way to the octagon. This is the first time in his UFC career he has worked his way to the main card. He has strung together some wins, looking at the rankings, and this guy appears like he belongs. A lot more eyeballs on him tonight. The audience is bigger. His popularity has grown leaps and bounds. We'll see if he can handle that pressure and perform the way he has that led to this main card slot here tonight. This guy is a very well-rounded fighter. He can do it all. If the fight takes place standing or on the ground, he's going to be comfortable in all areas of the game. All right, so here is this defensively gifted fighter. It certainly has some offense as well, but more often than not, that offense is set up by his sound defense. He uses movement beautifully, uses his defense to create offensive angles. This guy can stick and move with the best of the man, and even when you think you have him in a bad position, more often than not, swivels that head off of the center line and counters you right in the jaw. So an outstanding defensive striker, very good counterattacks, and a very interesting matchup in front of him tonight. This guy has some of the best defense I've ever seen inside the octagon, and they say that defense is the best offense. And now on of the tape for this heavyweight fight. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age. Some differences in height and reach as well. And now with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. You ready? You ready? Well, the United Kingdom boasts some of the most passionate MMA fans in the world, and they have packed the nines tonight. Good to have you with us as we get underway here at the O2. He's hurt here. 
block that kick to the body. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe, and his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He showed oh. Big left hand! Oh! oh. oh. He's out! Oh. Beautiful strike here to end the fight early in the first. Yeah, Joe, near-perfect technique to land that seminal blow to finish the fight here in round one. And that's exactly the way a fighter draws it up. You don't absorb anything in terms of significant damage, and then you're able to knock your opponent out. So this is exactly the desired result for him here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Take a look at this from a different angle. Crank right on the jaw. Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 24 seconds in the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Davis. Well, there have got to be few things sweeter, Joe, than winning a rivalry fight like this in the UFC. And you can see the celebration is on. And why not? Huge result for him here tonight. Ray Charles on the fleet. Uh. 